In this video, we are going to discuss about post layout simulation of CMOS inverter using Microwind DSCH. So, this is a schematic representation of CMOS inverter drawn using DSCH2. This is a layout generated by Microwind. This is a simulated output for the CMOS inverter. Next, go for the video. Next, we have to open DSCH. Open DSCH. Go to File, New. Then you have to draw here CMOS inverter. First, drag on PMOS. Then, drag on NMOS here. Then, we need one output. LED representation then we need one input pulse here it will be connecting VDD for ground we have to take this and then take the wire give the wiring connection Then save and go to file, save us. Uh, representing, giving the name inverter. Next, we have to simulate here. You can click run simulation. Now, simulation is run. Then we can stop it, stop here. Then you, you click this timing diagram we can see the response the input and output here 190, 190, this is the input and this is the output second row is the output here this is for verification of the CMOS inverter next go to file Click make Verilog file. So now the Verilog description is open. Same time in this folder, this Verilog description program is same time in this folder. The user where the software is available in this folder with the name of inverter. The program will be created. It will be uh, like inverter.txt. Then open microwind, go to compile, click compile verilog file. So open this inverter.txt, that is verilog file, then open. Then click compile. So corresponding CMOS inverter automatically the layout was generated with the test ones. That means with the help of input and output both automatically we have made the layout. Next you have to check the simulation that is post layout simulation. Click run simulation. So we are getting the output. So first one is clock here it will be 0 1 0 1 0 here will be any 1 0 1 0 1 0 like that will be any one. this is the output that is time voltage versus time next voltage and current this is the plot for the voltage and current this is the voltage this is the current plot next you can see voltage versus voltage that is input as well as here it is input clock this is output car 6 for the CMOS inverter next we can see the I diagram representation of CMOS inverter here also we can NMOS car 6 we can 
verify here.